The Indianapolis Public School Board will consider a new program that aims to keep students learning, eating right, and out of trouble both in and out of the classroom. Rich Van White tells us who's behind this program and why this one is so different. Holy Angels and three IPS elementary schools are test sites for a new ambitious after-school program. It's going to give kids academic help, healthy meals, exercise, and a healthy relationship with police. Many of the 100 students here come from some of the city's most impoverished neighborhoods. The area's only grocery store closed more than a year ago. Principal Matt Goddard. You seem excited about this. Really excited. If all goes as planned, RightFit will keep students busy and learning after school. They will receive tutoring, as well as lessons on nutrition, physical fitness, and proper behavior, along with visits from police officers and dinner. Yeah, it's not just uh, babysitting, supervising children. This is a phenomenal program because it addresses so many different areas of kids' lives. Elizabeth Edwards manages the school's meals and nutrition program. She's jumping at the opportunity to provide kids a healthy dinner that includes fresh fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. Something that's really going to fill them up and stick with them, and that's not something I think a lot of them are probably getting um, when they leave school. More than 40 organizations are supporting Right Fit. They include hospitals, universities, businesses, and several law enforcement and other public safety agencies. That is a school, you know, we are all about making sure we educate the whole child, and I think this falls exactly in line with that. Although there are many participating organizations, it appears as if the Indianapolis Indians and the team's vice president, Cal Burleson, are the force behind Right Fit. If all goes as planned, the program should begin in January.